Hi everyone, my name's Abby, I'm with CIS Abroad. We did get another question, it's why did you choose CIS Abroad? Okay, so I had a couple friends that I work with that went to that went through CIS Abroad and they highly recommended it and it has really good reviews and we go on all the excursions and everything is paid for and there's always someone to talk to <laughs> if you need help or anything and they're a very good program. So if anyone is even like remotely considering study abroad, I say just do it, just go for it because you'll love it and it's a once in a lifetime experience. And I liked being able to be part of a program too and have like a group of mm -hmm. a support system over here. And different from who you go to school with. Yes, yes. So I was able to meet new people, but also it was, I knew like I had people there too. Yeah, and the four of us are actually like, this is our normal friend yeah. group. So we all met through CIS Abroad. It's a really, really good program. We all met during orientation which and is a really good orientation. Like, no one yeah. knew anyone, and now we're all, like, yeah. really yeah. great friends. Yep. I specifically chose CIS Abroad because, um, like I was saying, I had a lot of options at my school. I could actually go through my school and study at a couple colleges in several different countries. But I liked how informative and how much CIS really assisted me while I was going through the application process. And I just liked the fact that there was so many opportunities for support. Like our on-site director, John, he's amazing. Love him. Yeah, the general consensus here is that we love him. He's <laughs> great. Um, hey, John, if you're still watching. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So John is so nice, so and so helpful. helpful. Yeah, so helpful. All the time, our group. Yeah, he's really on top of communicating with us, and it's really <laughs> nice. John's actually like. He's made the experience so worthwhile because the second day we got here, we went on a little excursion into town and he showed us around like where we need to go, um, what buses to take. He gave us a really good guideline of how to get around and how to function. I feel like CIS made it very easy and um, awesome really because they show us, John specifically shows us around and I feel like that's probably uniform throughout all the programs. Even if you aren't looking specifically into Ireland, I feel like, and I'm pretty sure that all of the um, on-site directors will take you around town and show you what, like, where you need to go, what you need to do, and then um, pretty much, keep in contact. yeah, keeping in contact. Text us all the time, weather alerts. Yeah, especially the weather alerts. We've had a little bit of a couple of wind storms in, um, in the past couple of weeks. Nothing too bad. Chickens. Yeah, he also John. Um, John's such a great guy. If you can't tell, <laughs> John <laughs> John buys us food a lot, and it's really great because um, at these um, like breakfast brunch type meetings, he checks in with us, sees how we're doing, and um, we actually have another one coming up this upcoming Monday. We love John. He's Woo! awesome. Thank you guys for listening.